guys and welcome to mel as well budget today i'm gonna be cash stuffing 500 dollars, and instead of putting it to the bank we're gonna be stuffing it into the 100 dollars envelope challenge i started this challenge at the beginning of the year and as you can see there hasn't been a lot of progress uh this challenge is a little bit difficult only because unless you're ready to tackle a lot of these bigger numbers the smaller ones as you can see are a lot easier to tackle um, so I wanted to go ahead and cash stuff all of this money since I met one of my goals um, and I was able to exchange a $500 placeholder into that envelope. I wanted to take this money and instead of putting it in the bank, I wanted to use it for my box. And I created these envelopes by myself. Uh, so I'm just going to grab a few of them just so you can get the concept of what they look like. So I just found... Well, I actually purchased um, a bunch of scrapbook papers and I made these envelopes. My hands are a little sticky um, in random fonts. And as I'm cash stuffing, I'm putting them in these envelopes. Okay, so I have my calculator here. We're gonna try and fill as much uh, boxes as we can and then we'll take it from there. So the first one I was not able to get change for is this $100 bill. This is real, it's super crisp as you can see. So we're gonna start and fill that $100 um, envelope, which is in the back. And I made these, like I said, myself. And then to track, sorry, we want to peeking out a little bit just so I can know that I filled that one in case I'm not looking at this paper. So we're gonna briefly scribble it. As well as I'm gonna count $500 on my calculator. And then as we put money in, I'm going to um, minus it out on the calculator as well. Okay. So I have two $50 bills, uh, which I already filled the 100. So I wanna figure out what these will pair with. So I'm gonna random, randomize some numbers in the 50s and let's see what we get. Okay. So I went ahead and randomized two numbers and Google random number generator selected 52 and 60. So let's start with the 52 first and then let's get the 60 next. Just look for that one. So we have 52, and I'm just gonna stick the pen here so that I don't lose my uh, my placement. So 52. I'm really excited to be filling these also because, as I said, I started this at the beginning of the year, and it's been very difficult to. Uh, fill these saving this saving challenge um, in particular but the other ones I've been really successful at um, I think it's just because I aimed for such a high goal and a lot of other things came up and this is my first couple of months of budgeting straight and being really focused with it so it's a lot harder than I thought it was going to be um, and then I want to subtract those numbers. So we have 288 still to play with. And I want to start minusing some of these um, smaller numbers out as well. So let's start with uh, 12. So let's see how much uh, if we did all of these. So we're going to fill from 12 to 18, so let's go ahead and do that now.
So before we go ahead and wrap up the video, I wanted to thank you all so much for watching. I hope that this is encouraging someone out there to start budgeting and being more money conscious. Also, uh, just to achieve their financial goals. Uh, again, I wanted to thank you all. Be sure to subscribe, like, and comment. And God bless. Bye.